Viewer discretion is advised. Really? Oh, are you okay? Oh. We have traffic Suck a cock and are you okay? Let's just get the hell out of here. Really. Uh, I say we should throw it to your gas. Let's do that. Double luck. Oh, Jesus, I'm on fire. Oh, my God. Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome to another episode of LS PDFR. This is day 21. This is LS PDFR 0 0.3, and today we're going to be doing a sheriff patrol in Polito Bay. We're going to be taking this Camaro SS 1969 by Neophyte Industries. It's available on GTA5Mods.com, as always. Uh, you know, it's a 1969 model, so the interior is only going to look so good. As you can see, they kind of screwed up the Camaro there on the passenger door but it's correct on the driver door. The gauges work, the mirrors do not. <clears throat> so, again, I don't really drive in first person, so it doesn't bother me. But, yeah, it's a, it's a nice day here in Polito Bay, so we will go ahead and get to work. I'm gonna be using the default sheriff ped. Uh, have found an issue with emergency uniform packs. Um, basically, uh, it randomly seems to put a uh, texture glitched bulletproof vest on your on your ped. So I'm not going to be using that today because it's really annoying. What kind of car is this? Like a fugitive. It's actually a police car model of that by Night Kid. It's a pretty good car. I've used it before. We'll go ahead and get on duty here in the Polito Bay. We ain't got no fancy, fancy police station, no fancy garage. We ain't got no fancy locker rooms. We know we just go to work every day, try to fight crime. That's what we're gonna do. All right, guys, we're going to roll with this here Charger by Martin CT. <laughs> I, I can talk like that, you know, the entire episode if, if you guys want me to. It makes no difference to me, but um, yeah, we used this Charger in a previous episode. I think it's a 2011. Um, comes with this Sheriff skin, which I really like this skin, so I replaced all of the other Sheriff cars with a variant of this skin. So we'll go ahead and uh, get on patrol here today in the Palito Bay. See what we can get into. Did uh, at the start of the shift we did make ourselves unavailable for calls. Um, <clears throat> even in that mode, you can still force callouts. So you know if that's what you prefer to do, is be unavailable and then just the callouts you you do have that option uh, we did get uh, gotten pretty much everything back to normal we got police radio did that guy just run a red I do believe he did I don't believe that light was green Right. Attention all units, assistance required. We have Check 1024, multiple officers down in uh Oh golly. Suspects are known affiliates <coughs> we got the a, law. Our all units respond code Police station is being attacked by the law. Four, seven, Robert, Nora, Ocean, one, three, six, a possible stolen vehicle. That was a stolen car, but it's his lucky day because the police station being attacked takes a little bit of precedence over that. Uh, we'll get our, get our carbine rifle out here, we'll hit Y to move in with SWAT, um, not sure who they're shooting at. This is an unreleased callout of part of Wilderness callouts, um, this is not a very big police station, so I'm not sure where the, uh, potential criminals are. 
did hit Y for SWAT to come with me, but they seem to be preoccupied, so we're gonna have to kind of Rambo style this. Got any more lost? Any more you guys? You got any more you guys want some of this? Be nice if SWAT would fucking help, but I guess they're preoccupied with something more important. I got reload. Watch my back. You just trifling. Don't know if there's oh, shit. You bitch. That's what you get. Man, I'm lucky she didn't kill me. Of course, the one woman is going to be hiding in the corner, waiting to shoot me in the fucking back. Alright, so we're going to be code 4 10 8. We'll uh, go ahead and get a corner out here to clean some of this up before we end the call out. Assuming that they can get through all these barricades. It's just nice to have police radio working again. And uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see. Uh, hopefully, I forgot to. Or hopefully, I didn't forget. <clears throat> There's the corner, but they are st stuck behind this barrier. I say, hopefully, I didn't forget to change the van back. There you go, guys. Come on, you can do it. Come on, you need me to push push the van for you. Get out of the way, buddy. You're in the way. Move. Yeah, I guess they're not gonna come. Alright, well, we'll just go ahead and end it. Attention all units. We are code 4. No further units required. And now the coroner is allowed to make his entrance. Uh, it looks like I might need some medical attention here, you know, because... Uh, for some reason, SWAT did not really help me out. We have a traffic alert on Procopio yes. Promenade. Still trying to figure out life cancel. here. Come on. Come on, guys. Help me out. Get out of your van. Go get these dead bodies. Okay? Yeah, you're stuck in traffic. No, you're fucking not. Alright. Again. We will try one more time. That's great. Yeah, yes. I can come anytime for an interview. Actually, I don't speak Chinese. And we'll fluently. see. Uh, I took a class in college. I can take more. There they are. We have a traffic alert on a uh, Procopio promenade oh, for narcotics in transit. Man, that sucks. And they're still not going to get out of the van. Okay, that's fine. We'll be code four ten eight. Let them figure out what's going on. So we're just going to go ahead and check the plate on this Blazer, aka all terrain vehicle. Suspect I don't think plate. they should be two, on the road. Nine, Lincoln, Victor, Lincoln, zero, two, two, no. No, 10, <clears throat> Something's going on behind us here. Attention all units. We've Good. got a possible 503 on, um... Units Great chasing this guy. I'm not sure why. We're gonna go ahead and try and assist with this uh, pursuit. Seem to see a lot of these in LSPDFR 0.3 now. Guess it's uh, something that was added, or the frequency is turned up, or something. There you go. Nice, nice fucking pit. He's totally 10:50. And he looks like he's dead. Make it count. Yeah, I think I think His that subject's going to be 1155. <laughs> trying to go in this guy's house. Um. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this guy's 
Holy shit! Inspired. Son of a we have traffic oh, okay. on I didn't even realize there was another guy in the car. Boulevard for an armored car robbery. Son of a bitch. Freeze! Motherfucker. God damn it. Oh, Jesus Christ. Stop! Freeze, motherfucker! Put your hands in the air! Put your fucking hands in the air! Stop trying to run! Stop trying to run! We've got report of animal cruelty on, uh, Procopio Drive. Units respond code 2. Okay, so, this guy was... An occupant of the vehicle. I, I, I still don't know why they were chasing him. I'm going to assume it was some sort of felony. Uh, either the car was stolen or some other type of serious crime was committed. Come on over here, uh, Chris Kingston. <clears throat> Alright, sir. We're going to go ahead and look you up in the system. Give me one second here. So, of course, nothing's coming back on Chris. Sir, I'm going to go ahead and ask you if you have any drugs or illegal weapons. Any kind of sticky, pokey objects I need to know about before I search you. No? Okay. Let's Let find out. Die. Yeah, well, that's what happens when you get arrested. Don't do stupid shit and you won't have to go through this process. Alright, so everything's good. Uh... We're just going to place uh, Chris here in our vehicle, so he doesn't get run over. Get in the police car nice and slow. And we will get him transported to the closest jail. God, I love your mods, Albo. Backup needed for a suspect placed under so arrest good. in Palato Bay. Victor 13! Hey there. You know that audio used to bother me when they would pull up and be like, Hey there. Or, Hi. But now I've kind of gotten used to it. You did add an option to turn that off, but I'm just going to leave it on because it's, it's just second nature to me now. So I guess these guys uh <coughs> left their car here. So we're going to go ahead and get both of these cars towed. This is cleaned up. He ain't worth the fucking steam off my piss. And we'll get this towed as well. I'm sure this guy doesn't want these two empty vehicles in his front yard. Two tow trucks at once. Uh, you know, if you guys find watching this kind of thing boring, let me know. I can, you know, I can edit this kind of shit out, but to me it's part of the whole LSPDFR experience, so. Anyway, while all that was going on, we did accept this illegal hunting call. Uh, for some reason it thinks that's my car. Let me get out and... There we go. You can see the blip change, so now it recognizes that this is my car. I guess because I got in that car for a second. But anyway, um... We are going to respond to this illegal hunting call. really not sure what the best way to get here is, so... Let's use the old GPS. I guess we are using the old GPS, aren't we? And it says you're going the wrong way, dipshit. So we will go this way. We'll go ahead and roll code 2. It's probably what they wanted anyway. But we were busy dealing with that whole fiasco. Yeah, just another day out here in the bay. Tell you what. Okay, so 
so... Just uh, another normal road out here in Palito. We, we can't afford to pave all these roads, you know. Got a limited budget to work with. I picked a pretty good spot for illegal hunting. I mean, he's kind of out of the view of everyone. I don't know who spotted him or called this in, but looks like we've got a dead deer carcass here. Big old buck. I don't know why I got out on the passenger side, but and these these guys do like to get feisty sometimes. So we'll go ahead and take our stun gun out. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and check the plate on this vehicle actually and see if anything comes back on that since we can do that again. It's gonna be 43 Charlie HY474. Four three Charlie Hotel Yellow four seven four Henry Young four seven four no ten ninety nine Okay, so the rebel's going to be registered to a Matthew Jefferson. How you doing today, sir? <laughs> yeah, we've got some reports that you're out here hunting illegally. Can I go ahead and see your hunting license, please? It's here. Well, I'm going to have to tell you, Tom, things aren't looking good for you so far. Let's go ahead and look Tom Linford up. So, he's driving Matthew Jefferson's truck, hunting illegally. What was his name? Tim Linford or something? Not. Was it Tom Linford? I, I, Jesus. The, the fact that I can't remember shit from 10 seconds ago kind of concerns me. Yeah, it was Tom. Tom Linford. Okay. Well, it seems his driver's license is suspended as well. Alright, Tom. Um, unfortunately, at this time, your license seems to be expired. Twat. Did you just call me a twat? Alright, sir. Whoa, 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 don't move. I'm going to have to go ahead place you under arrest for illegal hunting without a license. Just go ahead and drop that sniper rifle. That's funny. <laughs> He's got the sniper rifle still in his hand while being handcuffed. That's that's pretty good. I guess they didn't take that into consideration when they were testing this. Get in the car. In the police car. Now and uh, we're going to get transport out here for Tom. Or maybe we won't. Hmm, interesting. Take your sus... okay. Alternatively, press Y to force a spawn in the wilderness. Maybe we should have called for... Hey, um... Medivac... Air ambulance. No, I guess that wouldn't work because he's not. Never mind, I'm a fucking idiot. Assistance required for a suspect placed under arrest on Procopio Drive. We do, we are on our way. Abby. Roger. Did the. Attention all units, we are code 4. No further units required. Something seems to be glitchy about this spot. Nobody can get out on the driver's side. And then we'll go ahead and call a veterinarian to take care of this animal. Thank you. See if he can make it down here. Take care. 
Don't run me over, please. Don't run the deer over either, dude. Come on. Jesus. You guys are f absolutely fucking stupid. Here. Just, just get the fuck out of here. <clears throat> okay, looks like the veterinarian's probably not going to have a good time getting down here either, so... And we'll try to get a tow. No, this isn't the most exciting part of the game, but, you know, it is what it is. Cleaning up the scene, getting the guy taken to jail. Getting our car magically repaired. This is not a uh, particularly good spot to be calling, you know, three or four different organizations, coroners, tow trucks, veterinarians, transport. I don't, I don't think this guy's ever going to figure out where the hell he needs to go. Seeing the vet, no, the vet is of course down there on the beach. He's going to have a long stroll up here. And you don't get to see my new animal control truck because he parked down there. It's dead. Alright, well, be code 4108, we're going to get out of here. Okay, well, we're not going that way. Unless that's a stunt jump, and I don't think I had enough speed to make it if it is. And we'll see what else uh, we can get into today, guys. Out here in the bay. I'm going to run the plate on this Granger here. It's holding up traffic. And, uh, yeah. Just ran a red light. Target license plate. He Two, held up traffic, six, then he ran eight, the light when it turned red. One, four, six, no, ten, Michael Goodyear. License is valid, no active warrants. Not really liking that spot, they're pulled over. Let's come over here, go this way. To the right, to the right, please. That'll do. Alright, so we got some sheriff units. Chasing someone. We're we'll gonna make contact with this individual. See what's going on with him. Sir, the reason I pulled you over is because you ran a red light. You were holding up traffic when it was green. Butter with trash, he appears calm. Your glass piece of shit. Your glass piece of shit. I can see some ID, sir. Proof of insurance. Kip long. It is Michael Goodyear, everything does appear to be in order. How you doing today, Michael? Everything good with you? You had any, got anything illegal in the vehicle there? No, he says. Ooh, we've already checked that vehicle. I didn't even mean to do that, but that's pretty cool. Good job, Albo. Uh, have you been drinking today, sir? He says, nope. Done any illegal drugs? Not today. Oh, huh? what? That's good. I don't, I don't care if you didn't it yesterday. And I don't think we need to search his vehicle. We're just going to go ahead and give this guy a citation. And uh, we'll let him be on his way. Alright, sir. In the future, if you could avoid running red lights, that would be good. Alright. Have a nice day. Appreciate you.
Go check these people out here, make sure they're not doing anything illegal. Smoking any drugs. You can't be out here smoking drugs in the bay. Attention all units. We have a 503 on Procopio Drive. Alright, so we've got a Grand Theft Auto. We are going to respond to that code 3. See if we can get caught up to this individual. And we'll see how much backup gets automatically dispatched. It's my fucking turn. This guy looks like he's gonna be heading off-road. Well, not off-road, but not going the way I expected him to be going. And it doesn't look like we've got any backup dispatched automatically like you do in the city with 0 0.3, so that's interesting. I guess that's logical though, I mean, I'm not sure what kind of car it says, looks like a, it's going to be a Dominator or something, or a uh, Stallion maybe. Driving pretty slow though, Sabre GT, okay, I don't know what I'm talking about, obviously. Plate. And see how that other unit is running Charles people over and trying to join in to the pursuit with me. That's new with 0 0.3. It would be nice if he didn't run over pedestrians in the process, but... Alright, go ahead and pull this piece of shit over, dude. Use this garbage truck maybe to box him in. Come on, jerk him out of the car, jerk him out of the car. There we go. It's occupied times two. Fuck. Uh, motherfucker. And he's tripping up. Freeze! Put your fucking hands in the air! And they're shooting him. Put your fucking hands in the air. Get down on the ground. You're gonna get shot again. Oh, you're gonna get shot anyway. Oh, Jesus. Why do they do this still? Sorry, pal. I, I I tried to help you. I tried to tell you. Just get arrested, or you're gonna die, and that's, this is what's gonna happen to you. Fucking crazy sheriffs. We're gonna go ahead and call a coroner, because this guy's obviously been treated like a bullet hole pinata. <laughs> slow down traffic I'm not gonna use the default built-in system because traffic control Officers still works in, uh, and I don't like Bay. I don't like the default system because it doesn't give you like this yellow blip notification it's like corner stuck back there in the police car now Oh guys. Figure it out. Figure it out. There you go. Traffic flowing, we'll get the corner. There, everything's good. Alright, so pursuits out here in Polito Bay are not like they are in the city. Or at least Grand Theft Auto. Grand Theft Auto pursuits. So we're going to check this vehicle, we'll see if anything's in it. Make sure vehicle search still works okay. Get knocked down by the door. Don't know why that happens. Looks like one of the corners got left behind. That's this problem, not mine. He's just gonna walk back to wherever they work. I'm gonna go ahead and move my car so I can free up some traffic.
and search the bit of this car and get it taken care of. Nice brawler. An AK-47 in the hood. Alright. Well, that's interesting. I wouldn't... I would not store an AK-47 in my hood, but... I'm not a criminal. I'm just out here in the Palito Bay Sheriffing. So I don't know nothing about that. We'll go ahead and get this towed. And yeah, guys, I think that's... Probably going to do it for me. I'm going to be code 4108 off this episode. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. Uh, if you like the police station attack call out, that's going to be coming out soon. I know Alex is planning to release Wilderness Callout 0.5 relatively shortly. I know he's excited about it. Uh, it's a really good call out. He's a really good developer. We have person hunting without a permit on And yeah, I think that um, like I said that's gonna do it for me guys. Respond code two. I hope you are enjoying this content and hope you guys are enjoying LSPDFR zero point three if you're playing it. Uh you know, there's some good things definitely a lot of good things about it. There's some things I don't like, but we'll see what happens. The developers are very receptive to uh criticisms and complaints. So yeah, uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Take care.